I think you've got to bring everybody in to the decisions and the solutions to the challenges that we face. That's why we're, we're traveling everywhere, listening to everyone. We were in uh, Pacific Junction, a town that had never meaningly flooded before, just up against the Missouri River in Iowa. And every home in that community had flooded. Um, there were farms just outside of Pacific Junction that were effectively lakes. Those farmers already underwater in debt. Um, their markets closed to them by a trade war under this administration. And now they don't know what to do. We in our administration are going to fund resiliency in those communities, in Miami, in Houston, Texas, those places that are on the front lines of climate change today. We're going to mobilize $5 trillion in this economy over the next 10 years. We're going to free ourselves from a dependence on fossil fuels, and we're going to put farmers and ranchers in the driver's seat renewable and, and sustainable agriculture to make sure that we capture more carbon out of the air and keep more of it in the soil, paying farmers for the environmental services that they want to provide. If all of us does all that we can, then we're going to be able to keep this planet from warming another two degrees Celsius and ensure that we match what this country can do and live up to our promise and our potential.